Have you ever had a great idea or you really wanted to do something and then you checked it out online and you saw some other people doing exactly the same thing and you had that thought of like, well, damn, you know, other people are doing it. I might as well not do it. Have you ever had that thought? Well, if you have, today I'm going to give you an amazing practice that will help you to not sound like everybody else. Hi there, Rachel Jane Groover here, and you're watching Awaken TV. This is the place where you get your weekly practice on presence, purpose, and practical spirituality. And this week, this is for business owners or those of you that have a, a business or want to have a business on the side of how you can stand out and be heard in a different way. Because after all, there's not really any new ideas. There is a lot of people wanting to do or doing the same thing that you're doing, but I'm going to show you how to create a statement of difference in order for you to really look different to other people. In our Business Leadership Mastery Program, we get everybody to do what we call the Matrix of Communication, which is a whole ton of different things in how to pull together your messaging in order to stand out and, and be different to, in the marketplace. And one of those is what we call the Statement of Difference. This is a sentence or two sentences that describe why you are different to everybody else in your marketplace. Now, an example of what it's not a statement of difference is not just coming up with, well, I really care about my clients and I'll go to the next, you know, the, the, the end of the earth for them. Or I really go to the next mile with my clients and I work hard for them. Like that's not a statement of difference, but a lot of people use it as the statement of difference. The way you can tell whether you have a really great statement of difference is to look at your competitors, think about who they are. And if you went to them and said, do you do this? Do you stand for this? Would they say, yeah, or would they say, no, not really? You want their answer to be a no, or no, that's not really my primary thing that I put out. If you get yeses all the place, that's, that's going to be a lot of different photographers, artists, coaches, whatever you are, saying the same thing. And you don't want that but it's a little scary because you're putting yourself out there in a different way than everybody else is. Let me give you an example that we use for our business leadership mastery. We do a lot of business coaching for people who have a mission driven business who want to make change in the world in some way and have um, a healing or coaching or artistry or something that they want to make money doing. But if I went to all my competitors and I said, well, we're different because we work really hard for people who have a mission. They want something um, to do that's going to change the world and they have this mission and we're going to help them make money doing it. Most of our competitors are going to say, well, we do exactly the same thing. But if I went to them and said our fundamental way that we um, approach business is business is a spiritual practice. And we don't just teach people how to do opt-in pages, how to do freebies, all the things that you need to do. But this is about your personal work first. It's about your presence first and those business strategies second. Most business coaches have strategy first and all the other personal work second, which is why a lot of people go through business courses and they don't get the results they want because they're not working on their core fear habits. They're not working on their personal and energetic magnetism, on their leadership ability. And our Business Leadership Mastery Program brings personal leadership and business leadership together, but everything at its foundational place is business is a spiritual practice. It's going to bring up all your stuff to go through and that is going to be a process. So can you feel how that's different to like we help people with mission and make money and you know get the clients and all of that. It's it's a way that we've been able to carve out some difference in the marketplace. One thing that we are really good at here at Groover Seminars is messaging things that maybe esoteric or a little difficult to understand and how to message them in a way, how to write them and say them in a way that really get people's attention that stand out as different. So this is just the first part of what I want you to do. And it brings us to resource 
of the week. Our resource of the week is our Business Leadership Mastery Program. It is a year-long program. We're opening up a few spaces right now. For those of you that want a mission-driven business, yes, that are doing transformational work in the world, yes, but who really get that you have to do more or just as much personal work as you do business strategy if this is going to work. If you've been in a business course before that's just all about the doing and all about the strategy, you want to think about business leadership mastery. We have 12 topics, one per month on our personal side and 12 topics on our business side. We have been able to take people from zero to six figures. We've been able to take people to doing Tala Summits and putting a thousand people on their list to do events that bring in a lot of money through their workshops. All sorts of things we've been able to do for our clients over the last few years. So the link is below. Please take a moment today to check it out. You need business support and personal support in order to awaken your impact, inspire change, and create wealth. So consider joining us for our Business Leadership Mastery year-long program. And if you like this video, subscribe to this channel and feel free to share it with other people who are also on a path of personal and spiritual development. And I would love to hear from you. Post a comment or question below the video on, you know, maybe it's your statement of difference that you come up with and we can chat a little bit about that or any questions you have about how to stand out with your messaging and not sound like everybody else. And all the interaction happens over at racheljane.com. So head on over there now and leave a comment or question below the video. And remember, however you're feeling today, wonderful, amazing, somewhere in the middle, neutral, or not great, everything is temporary. So be as present as you can and enjoy each moment as much as you possibly can. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next week on Awaken TV.